Wait, did did my Centro just turn into a Palm Pre? Uh, that's just a little. I guess you can say opening line. Um, this right today, I want to show you guys the TLOS uh, skin for Palm devices, Palm Five devices, and uh, what actually it is. It's made from Teal Point. It's $14.95 and it's a skin for Palm devices that are running the Palm OS. And um, it's only just basically a skin that puts a new interface onto your phone, uh, which makes it resemble, it's based off the Palm Pre, which is coming out soon. Um, the Palm Pre is pretty much known for having a really cool um, UI we've seen from the keynote, and it's really impressive. So what Teal Point did was uh, copy some of the features and place it on a new skin for Palm Centros, Trias, so forth and such on. So the first thing you'll see here, it appears to have the Palm home screen with the wallpaper in the back and the four programs on the bottom. Um, you're able to launch new applications by clicking on the bottom and scrolling downwards. Before, um, on the normal Palm Center interface, you don't really have this graphic scrolling, it's just you scan downwards. So this is pretty cool. And if you want to go to a different category, which you can build through the menu, you can put games, so forth and so on. So let's say I open a calculator and calculator opens. Now let's say I want to go back to the home screen. Once I click this home button here, it returns back to the home screen. Here, there's a trial. And uh, here's the home screen again, but the actual application's in its own window. So using my finger, I'm actually able to move it back and forth, just like a very fancy touch screen, because it feels like the Centro doesn't really utilize its touch screen as much. And uh, if I don't want it anymore, if I want it to stop running, I can just flick it off out of the screen. Oh, let's see. Flick it off. And it stops running, just like the Palm Pre um, appeared to do in its keynotes. So I can run a whole bunch of applications. So let's open the telephone and the planner and all that stuff. On the basic, on the normal Palm Central interface, you'd have to go back to each application and such. But let's say I press this home button again, and those two programs I had opened are now coming in Windows. And I can zoom out and see which I want. And let's say I want to go back to the phone, click the phone appear back to the phone. Now let's say I want to get rid of all these. I can just use the up arrow button and stop the application. Really convenient. I really like it. Even if it's just a skin, it makes um, using the phone a lot more easier, a lot more efficient because you can just switch to the four applications or five applications you use the most without going through the menu system. Now let's go into the calendar again and here's a different way of launching your five favorite applications. I take out my stylus here and I lift upward. See, it takes a little trick here. Come on. Okay, there it is. If something appears called the Wave Launcher, and the Wave Launcher allows you to choose the five applications you use the most and makes it a little bit easier to launch applications. I personally don't use it because it feels like a, you need the stylus to do this, and I barely ever take out my stylus. I'm only taking it now for, you know, visual purposes. So let's go back to um, Memos and go back home and I'm able to flick out my applications. So that's just a pretty quick um, overview of the operating system. Uh, it's pretty easy to install. All you do is install from the website. It's $14.95 or you can have a 30-day trial and um, what you do is install it like a basic application. So let me just show you right now how you would launch it if you would are still on the um, old interface. So this is what the old interface would look like. Um, you just go back to this phone, home, now, if you want to relaunch it, or whoops, I'm going to go back. Okay. If you ever want to rerun the program, just go into TLOS and it relaunches. That's pretty much it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.